students good morning welcome to the english class i hope you all are happy and fine after your winter holidays and i hope that you're, you have done really very really well in your english exam so let us start a new lesson in today's class from your english textbook part 2 that is lesson 13 and what is the name of our lesson the name of our lesson is the travels of rasmina aunty so what we are going to learn in this chapter students in this chapter we are going to learn about a travel story of Ravina Aunty and she will be sharing her <coughs> stories to the two little pretty girl that is Preeti and Priya. Let us move forward. So let us quickly discuss the objective of today's class. So the objective of today's class is to enable the students to read the lesson well and understand and learn the new words. Alright, so we will be discussing the new words along with the pictures and also I will be reading the lesson for you okay so here is so before that let us uh, discuss few of the verse with the letter double e sound that means whenever we double e is there whenever we write some uh, words with double e with the pronunciation will be or uh, the words we have to stretch it it will become long for example you can see here in listen and say aloud feet f double e t feet so e sound is there if we say the if only single e is there then we will just pronounce e but here you can see there are two double e is there so it will be feet f double e t feet the next one is ship s h i p we say ship but here you can see it is given ship so it will be uh, <coughs> ship s h double e p ship heed h double e l heed keep it is not keep it is keep K E double E P keep after that peel P double E L peel next word is sin S double E and seen meet feel so these are the some of the words given here that is used here double E sound is used here so for example like this different kind of sounds you will be finding if you search in some other books and you can write your own also many of the words with this double E letter all right so now students tell me i think you all have done traveling you all we all love traveling is not it so i hope you all love traveling a lot and you also have a travel story so we will be discussing about the stories in our life class so with the swarm up questions what has been given have you heard about heard stories about travel from your family and do you enjoy listening to such stories and why so we will be discussing this questions in our life class let us move forward towards the uh, what is this chapter about that let us read a story about the different places that Ravina auntie traveled to so Ravina auntie she is doing some job and she works for a magazine and related to that she has to travel a lot to different places so here I'm going to do the reading of the text and please listen to me carefully please put your fingers on the text wherever I read <coughs> Ravina auntie is coming this evening says mommy Preeti and Priya jumped with joy. She was their favorite aunt. She had many interesting tales to tell. She worked for a magazine and traveled a lot. Ravina auntie reached at 5 o'clock. Hello, my favorite girls, she said. Come in, auntie, said Priya. We were waiting to hear your stories. Yes, I do. Have many stories to share, said Ravina, said auntie. Auntie, where have you come from, asked Preeti. I had gone to a desert. I went there with my friend. He is a photographer. He wanted to click photographs of the rising and setting sun. It was very hot in the day and cold at night. We had to travel on a camel as cars would get stuck in the sand. Before that, I was in the mountains, said auntie. Uh, what a different place from a desert to the mountains, said everyone. Yes, at that time, my friend had to click pictures of mountain lion. The villagers had seen the lion. Luckily, it was not snowing, but it was very cold with lot of rain. Were you able to click the pictures? He asked Priya. Yes, we, we set up a lookout point and covered it with leaves and branches. No one could see us. My friend has his camera ready. We had to wait for hours before the lion come. We were able to click just a few pictures before the lion ran away on hearing some. 
what a story said Prithi I am going to travel when I grew up me to say prayer so uh, after listening to Ravina and his different stories that is of the desert of the mountains of the tiger of the mountain lion so both the girls they were very much excited to uh, know all these things and they also had a urge to go for traveling so dear students this is all about the lesson I will be explaining this lesson to you in my next class now let us discuss the new words given here number one first word is jumped with joy so J U M P E D jumped with W I T H with J O Y joy jumped with joy so as you can see in this picture the child is very happy he is jumping with joy he seems to be very very happy the next word is number two is magazine m a z a z i n e magazine so you know it is an art it is a book having different kind of articles stories pictures as you can see in this particular picture magazine afterwards number three is desert d e s e r t desert as you can see in the picture it is a desert area you will not find any trees there sun is shining brightly and all of all you can see lot of sands are there okay so this is called as desert and this is all about this important new words in this chapter so my dear students what we have learned in today's class learning outcome is that we have done the reading of the lesson and we have also done the discussion of the new words along with its pictures and also we have discussed the some of the words that uh, is used where double e sound is used and when double e sound is there then we pronounce the word a little bit long like e p and he for example so i hope it is clear to you and please go through the lesson and learn the new words thank you and have